Joel Eriksson has been in Oman since 1973 working with fixed lines. So it's a long time. Actually, it's going to be 50 years this year. We have been helping the operators building out the infrastructure and by that mean we have been helping to diversify the sector that are relying on telecommunications, education, healthcare and so forth. And that's not all. We are continuing to do that with our cutting edge technology. 5G is the latest which we are rolling out here in Oman with our major partners which will lead to another opportunity set to diversify the economy of Oman. We are really part of Vision 2040 and that excites us a lot at Ericsson. As referred to earlier, we are installing 5G networks here uh, on top of the 4G that's already installed. We also have managed services. Our expertise help to run those networks perfectly and also the transport part. So that's a, that's a technological part. Here we are quite uh, ahead of uh, the technology curve and the sustainability curve. But it's not only technology, we also need the knowledge to be transferred to the country and which we do with delight to the Omani people with working together with the Ministry of Higher Education, Innovation uh, and Research, uh, doing a center of excellence here in Oman, dedicated on research on 5G and IoT and so forth and so forth to really make sure that the talents of Omani rises to the challenge to the Oman Vision 2040 and diversification of sectors as we just talked about. This is a very, very important question that at Ericsson we have been taking very seriously with uh, being carbon neutral by 2040. How do we do that? We do it from end to end, basically from the design of our product, minimizing the energy consumption uh, so that the network isn't consuming too much electricity. That's number one. And also even on the supply chain, we are making sure that what can be done remotely, what can be done in the cloud architecture, how can the resources be, meant, uh, be used efficiently. So all over from end to end, we are working to a sustainability uh, vision and that of course we are working closely with our partners in Oman who have that also at top of the agenda. So we are quite aligned and we actually are leading the industry in this regard. CG is an emerging technology right now which is currently being developed. We are looking at the standards together with other industry players, with academia, with government. At Ericsson, we recognize it will be a key shift to the next level of network with Internet of Senses as some of the features. While technology is getting simpler for the end user, such as you and me, it's actually getting more complex in the back end. So you need to have great talents to create it, research on it, develop it. So what we are doing here in uh, Oman, we are trying to upskill the younger generation to help the academia and the research with different programs that we have put together. So there is some work with the Ministry of um, Higher Education, uh, Innovation and Research to just have mentorship, project, collaboration and make people more at ease in such complex discussion, coming out with some concrete results. We have also created a center of excellence here uh, with the Ministry of Finance, with Omani students working on projects on 5G and IoT for the benefit of the Omani, Oman country. So here we have seen lots of use cases on agriculture, how to grow the crops more uh, uh, efficiently. We have also seen some uh, sustainability uh, program, how we reduce the amount of energy used across the, across the globe actually, which is quite impressive.